The first test method produces an initially slow growth smouldering fire, similar to overheated PVC coated electrical wires. The second test method produces a short period of smouldering smoke, similar to an overheating resistor on a circuit board. The third test method produces a large quantity of smoke and is used to imitate a fast growth fire. Both detectors were programmed to trigger the strobe sounder at the fire alarm level. Test 1 simulates an overheated PVC wire fire, which is lit on the floor at the furthest point of the room from the detectors. The Vesda Laser Plus detector on the ceiling goes into alert at 99 seconds. At 129 seconds, the Vesda Laser Compact detector across the return air grill goes into alert. The Vesda Laser Focus detector sampling in the cabinets goes into alarm at 137 seconds. At 145 seconds, the Vesda Laser Compact detector in the duct goes into alert. After 180 seconds, the point detector has still not detected the smoke. In test two, a PVC cable fire is lit on the floor next to the return air grill. The smoke is drawn up into the return air duct but does not reach the ceiling mounted detectors. The Vesda laser compact sampling in the duct goes into alert at 17 seconds. After 180 seconds, the point detector located on the return air grill has still not detected the smoke. Test 3 simulates an electrical component fire originating within a server cabinet that is ventilated from bottom to top. The Vesta sampling pipe is positioned across the top of the cabinet to detect the smoke as it is carried upwards with air currents. Point detectors are not positioned near the cabinets due to the negative electromagnetic effects on the server equipment. At 50 seconds, the Vesta laser focus detector across the top of the cabinet triggers the alert level. The Vesda laser compact detector, located across the return air grill, goes into alert at 68 seconds. At 71 seconds, the Vesda laser compact detector in the duct goes into alert level. After 130 seconds, the point detectors have still not detected smoke. In this test, the server cabinet is fully sealed and the sampling pipe is located within the top of the cabinet. At 28 seconds, the Vesda laser focus, sampling from within the cabinet, goes into alert. The Vesta sampling pipe is located at the back of the server cabinet to catch the smoke as it is carried with air currents. At 24 seconds, the Vesta laser focus detector goes into alert. After 130 seconds, none of the other detectors had detected the smoke. This test demonstrates how much smoke is required to make the conventional point detector go into alarm. At 31 seconds, the Vesta laser focus cabinet detector activates fire alarm level. At 35 seconds, the Vesta laser compact detector across the return air grill goes into fire one alarm. At 36 seconds, the Vesta detector in the duct triggers fire one alarm. After 70 seconds, the Vesda detector on the ceiling goes into fire one alarm. After four minutes and 15 seconds, the point detector on the return air grill goes into fire alarm, which does not meet the test requirement to trigger a pre-alarm within 180 seconds. The Vesda detectors are all at fire two alarm at this stage. In each test, the Vesda system detected the presence of smoke and raised the alarm while the fire was still in its very early stages. 
Vesda, coupled with intelligent response options such as automatic shutdown of